This morning in the backyard barbecue, how lucky are we? Our friend Matt McClellan is here from the backyard barbecue. What's happening, big guy? <laughs> Not much. How are you? <laughs> Good to see you. Thanks for hustling and get it to getting it sure. together right here. Uh, talk to me about what you'll be making. How do I pronounce this? That's Luby Sukar. He's my partner. He just, just ran to the car to change his shirt because oh. we're sweating. It's the backyard. We're, we're getting ready for the 4th of July. It's off to a good start, yeah. isn't it? What we're are you making? We're making barbecued uh, chicken. And today we're showcasing our, our barbecue sauce. We have a, a line of six fruited barbecue sauces. We've got honey, peach, uh, raspberry, apple, and... and uh, it's the last one, blueberry. I love it. And you guys have done such a great job. The Backyard Food Company, Matt, all kidding aside here for a moment, you guys have really grown these last couple of years. People really are taking a liking to what it is you're doing, aren't they? Yeah. We're in close to a thousand stores now up and down the East Coast from Maine to Miami. Right. Yeah. We're, we're bringing our backyard to their backyard. That's what's great. And this is really the weekend for this. Fourth of July weekend is upon us. Summertime is here. People want to get outside. They want to do some grilling. And you really can steer them in the right direction, can't you? Yeah. It's, look, you're outside with family and family and friends I mean there's no better times it doesn't matter if you light your grill on chicken and burn the burn burn it down you know they're gonna have a good story about dad in the, in the future right and they can make fun of him for years to come on the exactly. 4th of July which your kids I'm sure are already doing sure <laughs> No, all kidding aside, again here, Matt, let's talk about the ingredients you have laid out here before us. This is just a way to have fun and to get creative in the backyard, isn't it? Sure. Can we have Luby jump in? Yeah, too this while is we're the here? aforementioned Luby. So, so that's the name of the partner, not the do dish. Yeah. How are you doing, buddy? I'm so, sorry so about we're that. Doing, okay. like, we're just showing you have the backyard, you have friends over. Here's a charcuterie board. We've got pickled carrots and beans. Uh, we've got our salsa. You know, who doesn't like chips and salsa? We have a new cocktail sauce. You know, all the things you're going to have to entertain your family and friends. We have the whole gambit covered. No, you uh, really do. And I was talking to Matt about the way the company really has grown. You must have so much pride in what you're doing. We absolutely do. You know, we started from our gardens in our backyard, mm -hmm. and we really turned it into something uh, awesome. We no, love it. No we doubt. a lot of pride. And, you know, it's, it's really about the backyard. It's really about the backyard feel. It's, it's the memories you create in the backyard. It's, uh, we tried to encompass that in our products, and I think we, we did an okay job of having it come through. So. And not only that, they have these handsome t-shirts. Where's mine? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I was sold to bring you on this morning and totally forgot. Do you have tank tops? Because yeah. I've been working on my body. Do you guys have a favorite? Beach body? <laughs> you got the beach body? go that far. Yeah. Do you have a favorite product in your current lineup? Can I tell you, it's like asking who's your favorite child. Well, yeah. It's a hard one. Uh, lately... It's been candied jalapenos, but these barbecue sauces are so phenomenal. They're so unique. We really tried to revolutionize barbecue. Most barbecue sets in the, in the market, they have the same old stuff. It's a repeat uh, from each different company. We thought we'd try and revolutionize it a bit, so we infused fruit, and we use real fruit. Our, our food is real, so we said we're not going to use flavorings, we're not going to use juices, we use real fruits. Uh, we puree it right into our barbecue sauce, and I'll tell you, the outcome is fantastic. It's delicious. Well, it's that fantastic. is why you two fine gentlemen are here. It's great to have you with us. Thank you for joining us right. here on this great fine Friday here. morning. We're off and running here. We'll have more with these guys in a bit. Back to you. We are back in the Backyard Barbecue with Matt and Luby from the Backyard Food Company. I'll tell you what, looks great, smells great, and look at us. We match. It's like our patriotic photo. <laughs> Cheese, guys. Happy 4th. That's your postcard right there, right? We gave everyone that opportunity. But this is really where the attention should be because you've created such a spread, Matt. Tell us all about it. Yeah, we kind of threw it together this morning. We're like... This is what everybody's doing this weekend. You have your friends and family over. You're going to be cooking chicken or yeah. pork on the grill, burgers, hot dogs, you know. Mm -hmm. Have a charcuterie board. We've got chips and salsa, shrimp cocktail. We got it all. Yeah, and Luby, you, I, I like that, you know, we're taking the staples. We don't have to rework our whole menu for the weekend. Exactly. Maybe yep. pick up a couple bottles here. What yep. what did you put on, on each item to really amplify it? So our goal is to make your life at home as easy as possible. Okay. And what we want to do is we want to take easy staples such as chicken, uh, and you put some peach barbecue sauce. It tastes like you went to a barbecue uh, restaurant, uh, mm -hmm. and it's really delicious, and it adds a little bit of something different uh, and flavors that most people like. Yeah. Uh, we added that to the chicken. We also have some ribs here. We coated with some barbecue. We literally just slow cook these until the end. In the last five minutes, we'll put the barbecue sauce, let it caramelize, and seal out all those flavors. The other thing I want to mention about these is that we don't use high fructose corn sy syrups. We don't use flavorings. Awesome. Uh, it's all natural, and it really comes through. You mentioned peach. You've got raspberry, blueberry in terms of the, the barbecue and sauce. Apple, and honey, apple. and original. Wow, that's yeah, we, awesome. We tried to cover the gambit. 
you done to the uh, hot dogs? And we, what do you do to the hamburgers? So we have our sweet red pepper relish and hot red pepper relish, a jalapeno relish. You know, oh, so great for the. Uh, Great for the hot dogs, and mm -hmm. then you have a burger with a little bit of uh, barbecue sauce on the top. That's yeah, our hey. apple barbecue sauce, which goes great with a burger. That is so good. A variety of pickles too, because I don't I don't know about you, but when I'm having hot dogs and hamburgers, I want the everything on the side. Absolutely, you know, Michaela. That's the thing is when you add these condiments and you add these toppings, it, it really elevates the game. Yeah. It elevates the backyard barbecue quite a bit, and uh -huh. that's what we want to do. We want to make every chef look like a hero. Oh, <laughs> to well, their family, you know, when they, everyone bites into that will, food, yeah. uh, and, and not in a pretentious way. Yeah, you know, right. we're two dads. We we grill for our kids in the backyard. You know, uh -huh. chicken seventy nine cents a pound. Everything's expensive right now. You yes. take a cheap meat, you put our barbecue sauce on it, and you've got like a really high high scale meal at home. You were saying it's going to taste like something that maybe you, you order out, but for for less of that cost. Because when you're cooking for a crowd, you got to be mindful of your Absolutely. budget sometimes, too. Absolutely. Our our camera and Eric was noticing that, that cocktail sauce, too. I don't <laughs> think I've ever had, like, a homemade It's delicious. Sauce. We we don't use any additives in there that, uh, shoot, it's all natural. We use okay. natural horseradish. There's no natural, there's no other flavorings added. Uh, we, we really highlight the sweetness of the tomato. Yeah. And it really comes through nicely. People love it. It's a, it's a wonderful cocktail. Uh, people it's really a, do uh, love it. The guys are uh, I don't even this. know. I don't even know where to where to start. I mean, well, I guess I'll have some chicken because this looks fantastic. Uh, but make sure you pick up some of their items and really uh, take your barbecue to the next level this weekend. I'm not getting a cut of this, but I'm telling you, go out and buy this jalapeno relish because it's my favorite. <laughs> Thank you. Thank what you. was Thank your you. name again? Uh, put this, uh, <laughs> I'm putting this. I'm putting this right in the pocket right here. That's fantastic. Happy Fourth, guys. Happy, happy Fourth. Happy fourth.